Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. I'm delighted to be able to bring you live coverage of this game from the Eredivisie. Stuart, this should be high-intensity stuff. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. The initial 11 today for the hosts. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre-backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, on paper, it looks a fairly cautious approach because unless their wing-backs can get into more advanced areas, I'm not sure where the attacking width will come from. And so the battle commences. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. And taking it away. Brown. Schoener. Oh, just wide of the mark. Goal kick. Well, that never looked like troubling the keeper, did it? But it was worth an effort. A good strike from him. Azur. It's with Vitek. Sondre Tronstad. Jordi Brown. Perfect challenge. Duki. Dasa. Matusz Bero. And Bero on the ball. And the poor touch didn't help them on the possession front. Pressing high to win the ball. And using his body to good effect. Must be! And how well the keeper did. Well, that's just exceptional. He reacted so quickly there. Corner kick played in. A goal! They've opened the scoring in the derby. And I'll tell you what, you can hear a pin drop in here. Yeah! 
Well, here it is again. It's a good delivery from the corner, and then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. One nil then. Mikael Duelund might be able to get in behind the defence, but really sticking to the task defensively. Sondre Tronstad. And Berro on the ball. And moving the ball nicely. An incisive pass. And there it is, the goal they wanted for security. They lead by two now. They can breathe that bit more easily. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. It's going their way, 2-0. Going well. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Well, the visitors have controlled possession, as you can see. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Spraying passes around, almost waiting for the opposition to make a mistake. And well, they've given him too much space. It might be on for them. And clears his lines. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Openda. Fluency of movement. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Eli Dassa. Duki. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. A possession lost, intercepted. And that's gone out of play for what will be a goal kick. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. 
número 20, Ushama Tanabe. Dasa. Can they create something from here? Sondre Tronstad. And possibilities here. Oh, a lovely ball. Well, the conclusion, he's missed the opportunity. Useful looking position, you've got to say. And he takes it on! Well, he's bound to be disappointed with himself. Not a great effort, Stuart. Well, the less said about that, the better. Not a good decision from him. Will it happen for them? Dangerous looking attack. Just cutting off the supply. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. Brown. Will he find the net? Well, not on the target. The keeper seemed to have it covered. Well, he did seem to have it covered, but it's not a bad effort, though. He really did strike it well. Osama Darfanu. Chance to do damage. Options in the centre. Well, they keep passing away. Can they get in behind them? Chance to finish. Well, the cross played over, but ultimately up a cul-de-sac. Just 10 minutes to go. Chance to attack using wit. Schoener. Well, the keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Substitution then, let's see how it affects the match. Corner kick played in. And the danger cleared. Taking it away. Edgar Barreto. Schoener. Fantastic work. Ball is loose. Well, they can keep possession of it now. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. Sondre Tronstad.
And now it's Tanan. Openda. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. You're absolutely right, Derek. They really struggle to get to grips with the game. They always seem second to the ball, and then just a few mistakes at the back, and it's cost them. Poor performance all round. But it just seems that this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he should be pleased with himself today, because he performed really well, he scored a good goal, and they won the game. An excellent day all round.